Laison Gang Nets as Shampana. In today's opponent is one of the original teams that started throwing money around like it's confetti and winning championships with it as well. Yes, that's right. We're up against Toulon, another team in the fight, in the battle, inside the top four of the top quartiles. Bonjour, everyone, and welcome back along to Montpellier Career Mode here on your home of rugby. Today, we are really getting into the business end of the season. Toulon are... Well, we're at their home, so they're not anywhere. Toulon are at home. We've come to barge down the door. And this is second versus fourth. Toulon are right in the mix, but they're in a bit of a battle of their own. Yes, third place, Leon is fighting with us in second. Clermont are clearing away in first. But there is a battle down with Toulon. There's another team right below them or two that are on equal points and right within striking distance. They've lost two in a row and they can't afford to lose another one. Now this is not the Toulon side we know of the past with all the superstars but wait till you see their bench and like we won't see the players on the reserves are uh, at times even better. But they do have a very strong side and a second row with MS Bev and Leon and Nakarawa is absolutely fantastic. They do lack in other areas on the greatest front row. The back row has question marks, but luck of fear and especially Cornell the player at number eight will be ones to watch out for. It's an exciting little nine and ten with Takalua and Paiawa in the halves combination. A bit of power on the wing with Tino Namani on the left side. And look out for what they can on the right. Larry is a man who has carved us up many, many a time. So, we've got plenty of targets to look out for. Vlair is certainly the number one. Up against them, though, you may have noticed the king is back. The captain is back. Marco Zola Mpimpi here to reign supreme yet again. Other than that, our team is pretty much unchanged. Just Mpimpi in. He's back from injury. But we still do have six players who are missing through injury as well. And pretty much all of them are going to miss the rest of the season. As for Toulon though, they're missing no one and that kind of seems like it's almost unfair. Now take a look at the bench and there's probably, I, I don't know, four big names on here. Tolofu and Brooks in the front row certainly are very capable players. Of course, Parisi in 20. But then we look at 21 with Baptiste Sinan and 23. Let's not take it away from Cheslin Colby. How do you mean beat those guys out? How? I mean, what sort of stupid stuff are they doing up in that little corporate box? They don't select players like Saren Colby, but he says especially in that starting 15. On the more sane side of things here in my Pallier, we've got a good starting 15. Our best, let's be honest, and we've got a capable bench behind us. Ratigs moves to 23, of course. That sees Resamit out of the 23 starting here tonight. So... Let's get down to action. Toulon in a must-win game for both teams. Right, of course, we know the colours by now. We're in the black and blue. Toulon playing red. You know how it goes. Let's get into the action. We're on the road, of course. Big game, big points, big competition for our second spot. And Toulon's fourth as well. So let's make sure we play our best sort of rugby. It's underway with Dave Friesen with an early take there for the tight end drop. And from Tuckalula goes over here to our defensive line, sits up and waits for Malins and back in the action very quickly there. Release. Is Mpimpi. Swinging to the left hand side now. Nice small fellow off, finding it from Bumba, but the pass from the corner. What a play! Pinavani! Oh, he's kept the spot the 13 and he's shining bright yet again. Lagrago off the middle. Now on the outside, looks to Dimba Bumba. Inside pass to Dolph for Fanua. Now the offload not quite there. Near the 22 now. Good start here from Montpellier. Prasang seizing the power. Maybe a metre games. Maybe half. We'll take every single millimetre we can get. Flank hard. Big charging run from the second rower. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Trouble here. The red of Toulon may turn this ball over. They do. Toulon gives the big boys. Nakarawa. Advantage. Wide. Knock on. And the first. 
first mistake. Ramirez out on the inside centre. A little bit too aggressive on the carry in that occasion. So close to their 22. You'd think they'll just get rid of it. Good tackle from Thomas. Crouch. Picked him up. Find. Driven into the ground. Set. Dan McDermott has got the ball. Scrum back down for Tom Kelly. Eight. That's a good scrum too. Man, we love that. Here's Lee Tanaga. A little bit of Ruby on the short side of the seats. Elena Thomas. Thomas looks to the corner. Oh, it's Jimmy sitting down. Thomas up again. And put down. Massive tackle. Here is McDermott. Lee Tanaga looking to power. Doesn't quite get their turnover ball. Big play as well. And a kick away from Blair will clear all the pressure. The luck of fear. What a turnover from the open side flanker. Well, we're knocking at the door. That much is for sure. But we haven't managed to get ourselves over that white line. Frank Rock pops it down to McDermott. And here is now Marpay. Strong carry. And back towards that 22. Oh, he's offside, Ref. Come on. Oh, that's a shocking call. Turnover for Toulon. No, we just won't play offside now, will we? Is that the game we're playing? This is a turnover. Mick Drink, surely Frank White does well. Demba Bumba, Alana Bello, the King. Inside, outside, King. Where are you going? The Pepe. He's there. Marcus Ola, back in the team, back in the tries. Well, he kept everyone guessing, even Bello. He didn't know whether to pass it inside or outside or upside down or next door neighbor. He didn't know where Mapimpi was going. Demba Bumper on the link up. Watch Mapimpi. He's like this side, no that side. Takalua had a go, Mapimpi swatted him away like an annoying little fly. Splattered against the window. And that's a great start. Eventually, a domination turning into points here against Toulon, just what we wanted. Took us nearly 20 minutes though to get those points on the board, which is a, a little bit of a concern, but aside from that, it is a dominant start for Montpellier. We turn the five into seven through the boot of the number one, number 10 in this competition, surely Anthony Bello. And we make the start a fairly successful one. Here is Takua kicking off. It's a deep kick off as well. Finds Blasine to Gomez. Oh, that's a high shot. All oh, his trouble straight away. Man, is Takua doing everything? Is he the captain, the kicker? And the. Oh, he's, who's got the. Is that Takua who's got the card? Oh, my goodness. Well, it seems Hand was the one that is the captain. And it looks like Takua has been sent off. So pressure now goes on Duncan Paiola. And you see Tate McDermott and Anthony Bello are looking a little bit amped. They're like, yes, now's our chance to take control of this game. Give it a Sally throws. Nice at the front. Delta Fedora does well. Here is Bello. Lamarpe, the deep line. Pitavani gets it at a shocking pass. And it's turned over from Toulon. Inside ball finding it to be very nicely. Blair does brilliantly. And a runaway here from the Blair. Up towards the Montpellier, 22 he goes, proceeds, turns it over, McDermott trying to get rid of it, Lamar Pay can't do it. The ball spills free, too long pick it up again, and it's a Biff. Finds a little bit of racing room, down the short side, dominant tackle. Oh, Placines is on everything tonight so far. McDermott trickles around the corner and finds the big man, and it's a bit, there's Valera on the Did outside Manitoba. again, Lamar Pay. Looks to take him into touch. Great tackle, now Marpe. Oh, the ball scrubs out. McDermott, like myself, thought he was out. Great break through the middle. Now a little grubber in behind from Paola. It was, well, it was high average. And it just lets us reset. Wind down this pressure time. Although they are a man down, so we should be using this to our favor. Bello. Well, he's given that a good old bellow down the middle of the park. No one knew that was coming. Eventually, they get their head tail does I see an offload away from the prayer. Very good. They almost break us in half straight away there. Down the left side, looking for a bit of room there. Stamani! Oh, it's an injury. Uh-oh. That means... Uh-oh. 
23. Oh, big Ottos! Left wing, Cheslin Colby is on. Tino Amane goes. Neck injury, but that was an injury we probably didn't Crouch. need to see. Bind. Here is a man that can absolutely Sit. change a game on a dime. And his impact already has made me Mr. Scrum hit. So that's, that's what Colby does. Look out for 23. He is going to be a menace. And they go back to that side as well. If they can free him up. It looks like Tuckalo is still. Oh, he's back. Tuckalo is back on the field. The yellow card has been all to the advantage of Toulon. Kick over the head of Padovani. Malins looks to cover back there as well. Uh oh, Malins gives to Padovani. Oh, no. The pass was poor. Looking for Mapimpi. Looking for a way to break out. Of our own at 22 with ball in hand has backfired somewhat and as half time rings in our ears. Oh, turnover! Van Quan, what a bellow! He's running! Not sure what he's doing there for. Oh, massive shot on McDermott! Oh, come on, Bellow, you shouldn't have done that. Right, I see Bellow going way, way back. And that is where we're going to finish things for the first half. It's been a quiet one on the scoreboard, but a a very strong defensive effort. Let's say that much from Toulon. They're under the pump for a good 20 minutes before we scored the opening points of the night and the only points of the night as well. We have dominated this game. Possession, territory, both massively in our favor, but we've only got seven points on the board, which is, um, well, let's be honest, it's a massive concern. Right, Cheslin Colby. It's taken over the kicking duties from even Tuckalua. So let's see how that changes things. It's a deep kick off, much like we've seen already. And Wadaio oh, caught flat footed there. Big punishment. McDermott fires it back to Bellows. So well, I didn't even have anything to say about that. He squirted into touch. Which is fine. It's fine by me. It's fine as long as the fight's touch. I'm good. Right, still danger though. And we did nick their last line out just before half time. So let's see if we do. Oh, we've done it again. Too easy. Too easy. What's going on here? No one's wanting to run. Get in there, boys. Well, okay, that was a bit weird. We have got ourselves possibly, yes. Now things are starting to go a bit more normal. Here's Placent. Oh, he's knocked it on. That was a great run from Placent. And again, it's picked up from Takalua. And we will reset things for a scrum. That was a great run from Placines. We get to see it again. It was almost worthy of it. McDermott went sideways. Placines hit it at pace. Oh, a monster of a fend. I think that's Valera as well. They got pummeled for his efforts. Over the ball. Crouch. Come to Sally. He said thanks very much. Bind. He's like another bloody flank that guy. He's, he's insane. Good scrum here from Tumon. They are in a dangerous area too. Look at this. Just inside the 10 meter line. Plyala goes out wide. Dakri off. Oh, it's knocked on. Caught it up in the line. Spills his beans. Now, Bello gets a wide out to Mipipi. Draws and passes Advantage to Pinavani. He's got no Mape. And you can sign this one off. It's a game winner, surely, for Montpellier. A spectacle of expensive, explosive counter-attacking rugby from Montpellier. Big runs off the mistake. And just look how, oh, just how fluid it is. It is liquid rugby. It is beautiful to watch. And everyone knows the plan. La Mape gets the try. He's back from a decent little injury knock. That sort of missed a lot of big games. But now he's back, and he's back to win a top 14 title. It is 12 points to nil. Toulon yet to really fire a shot as Anthony Bello adds another two. And we have a 14 point scoreline. 14 to nil. Toulon haven't given this guy the ball enough, let's be honest. Placine just getting ready to make someone hurt. As Colby goes short. Oh, good to Sally Smoked and a big hit from 
the two up forwards. They'll turn it over. That's the game plan. And they've executed that to perfection. Now it's why Thomas up against Cole. He top, what's he done there? He's just, he's just chipped it into touch. First chance, first real attacking play for Colby. And he's made a bit of a mirror of it. Here's Gilda Sally. He'll pop it up. McDermott says, get down that end of the field. Colby's raced up on that though, and he's, he's not got it. He's left it until it's full back, and that's an average kick for Watson to pick up. And Flanquan is running from distance. Chance for another one here, possibly. For Montpellier. Let's see what we can cook up. Pacines. Oh, that's a great line from the Oh now Mopi! The defender in a bit of a needed! The Gomez is done brilliantly! And Pinovani will dot it down. What could it be? A beautiful try to watch. Almost looked a bit awkward. Eduardo Pinovani finishes in style. But watch this. La Mape overcomplicated it. Look at that, he done the player in. Oh, unbelievable. With a great offload, Sewell was there. Bellow wanted a nab as well. He wanted a touch. Three unanswered tries. One-way traffic, really. It's been quite a good display. Can't think much other way to describe it. It's not been too fancy. It's just been solid. 21 points to nil. As Bello adds another two. And you've got to be happy with this. You've got to sit down and smile and say, yeah, the top three are where this competition will be won. Four, five, and six. You might as well not even turn up. Let's be honest. Here's Colby. Another day, though. Things could surely be different. That is a great offload. Now Gomez is away. Look out for the king. He's there. Bonus point win. It's in for Montpellier. And Colby's done nothing but run halfway to goalposts and go back to halfway again. Marcus Oliver Pimpy. But let's give it up for that man, Plessens. Gomez. Like a buffalo in the wild. Had too much time to think about it. And Mpimpi just tempered his run, kept in pace, and when he got that ball on, oh, went the burners. What a try. Well, I called it solid before. Would you maybe go one little bit step higher and say, nice? Oh, I can't think of many other words that aren't either really good or just average. It's just been a good display. Solid, nice, tasty. Do we go tasty? Crafty. That man's been a shocker. I was worried when he come on. I was like, oh, 7-0, the game's going to change. But when you got Placides on the field, he is a master strike of a player. And he's on the ball again. Uh oh, Bellow, get rid of it. Oh, no. Well, nice we kick to touch would be suffice there. We'll give it to McDermott to do the job instead. And that is a great kick. Oh, Tate. Come back next season if we need you. Well, as we stand right now, there's three teams that I think are good enough to win this competition. Leon sit down at four, uh, third. And maybe second. Who knows? Of course, Montpellier, oh, we've just nicked them off again. We are just on fire at the moment. Our set piece is good. Gomez is doing Gomez. He's injured. He's injured. He's broken. You knew a mile away. He went into contact. He couldn't offload. But it's okay. It's okay. Lucid said prop. We've got Pedro's to come on. Gomez was having a great game as well. He looks back with a little bit of regret in his eyes. But opportunities arise. And injuries. We know are her massive part of the Crouch. Safe. Find 28 nil. Set. Not too long would have actually given us a little bit of a threat here. I thought they would have given us a bit of a challenge. Offered up very little to nothing. Here's where did I go? To no one. Thomas grabs it. Oh, wow! Release. Colby has shown the body at that one. It's McDermott for Saints. Runs into contact. Oh, he's lost that. It's a big time over here now. It's White Storm. I've got work to do. And he gets it done, Dakarine, no chances, a turnover, surely. 
Bellow was up on there very fast, but Toulon somehow hold on to it. They don't know who wants the ball. That is a great little break there. Busting up like a fear. Oh no, our players are hardly on side. Yeah, another good hit up there. Tuckaloo it like he does. He's hardly seen the ball. That's a shocking play. Short side, there's no room. Now they give it to the forwards. Like a fear again. It's another strong carry. Tuckaloo went short side. They changed their mind and back to Nakarawa. Now there's room and there's numbers and there's space. Great off by there, Oh, this is brilliant for the moment for Toulon. How do they do this? Big run from De Pere. Now to 22. Tuckaloo feeds it out wide. Colby. They give it to him and say, do something special. Play out against the back. And he gets to answer Beth, who only knows one way. A defensive line holding so far. Not too bad. Like fear again, it's the man who starts it all, and Nakarawa is the one who finishes it. This is very good from Toulon. Into the 22. First time they've threatened our line all night long. Into midfield they go. Poor from Hiratai. Sits up. And Tuckalore again. Barges through. Get in there, lads. Well, we tried to nick that one. Not quite quick enough. Dupreer gives it off. Shorts on. That's a break ball. For feet to the star. Our line to play. Oh, and the try will finally come in the 87th minute. Duncan Playawa. Well, they've been pretty average all night, haven't they, Toulon? But they just start to get going after the 80th minute. Oh, this is looking for an opportunity to try and turn that over. That ball from Fafita, that was what changed things. And they just wanted to give a chance to Cheslin Colby, but he couldn't make things happen. Paiawa, who has come into the game in the last 15 or 20 minutes, does get a little bit of a reward back, and unfortunately, I'm kind of annoyed. We've not kept them in a donut, but 28 points to a possible seven will be a good win for us. I'm happy enough with that, a 21 point victory. Go home happy and smiling that we have just taken out fourth place, and they probably will drop to fifth as well, if not worse. That is a good win for Montpellier. Solid performance. Good tries. Periods of dominance as well. And we shut up that man, Valier, who could have potentially, along with Colby, been a devastating pair for us at a fan. Four tries to one. Playoff were the only scorer for too long. Colby, of course, the conversion. Bello, though, the man for Montpellier. Four conversions. And, of course, the back line... That did all the damage. Padovani, Laomape with one try each. Because the king on his return. A royal welcome back to Marcus and Pimpi with a double. The stats did not change too much. 70% possession at half time, 68 at full time. And when you don't give a team the ball, they ain't going to score too many tries. And that's what we did. It was pretty good effect tonight. Territory evened up though. We were happy to play it out of our own areas, put pressure on them through the set piece, which is pretty poor for Toulon. And in the end, six line breaks of four. We made better of our chances here tonight. A good win, 28 to seven. I thought it was gonna be a bit more closer than that, but for sure, I will take a bonus. And that is only our 13th of the season. And we need those every single one, because Leon are right there. Of course, one piece of bad news from our good win tonight over Toulon is that Gomez it's going to miss some time. It's not too bad, actually. Three weeks, um, and of course, one week's already will be gone. Probably we should see him back into the season, regular season at least. We are going to be in the playoffs, of course. So we will get him back later on. And his impact is pretty good. I bet is a good player, but Gomez just has that little bit something, that little bit special about him in this team. Right, round 26. I think this is our final round fixture as well. Leon. 97 points equal with us they have lost two more games than us so we're already in a better position there but they do have four extra bonus points which is the big difference of that victory to loss record so if we win this game doesn't matter how many or how much if we win we're good lose with a bonus we're still good lose without a bonus and then we get into maths and numbers and no one really wants to know about that. Leon, though, have done well. Two on a drop. Stade Francais. Look at them go. They have overtaken them. Toulon on a three-game losing streak. 
to just about wrap up this season. Toulon alongside Bane, Racing and Bordeaux are the only teams to finish the regular season so far. So they will not go anywhere. You can see Racing down there won't be passing or dropping to anyone. Cast could possibly get up to 24. <laughs> yeah, right. Like they're going to win their fourth game of the season this year right at the end. Uh, and of course, what else we got there? Bordeaux in seventh. They're not going to trouble the top six, which is decided. The big question is, though, Toulon or Stard in fourth and fifth. And, of course, for us as well, of course, if we don't win and we lose by a decent margin, there's a chance that Lyon could overtake us. But look at Clermont. That is disgusting. 22 bonus points. Points of potential plus 439 and 110 points. That is just insulting. Right, that is it. Final game of the season, La Rochelle. A team, again, much like um, what these guys used to be good. Season one, they were the surprise package. Season three, they are not so much the surprise package. We're going to go all guns blazing. Or are we? Or are we, actually? Because we only need to just win the game. And La Rochelle, as we can see, are down in ninth. Just 11 wins, one draw and 13 losses. We could rest a few stars for the playoffs, which I think would not be a bad idea. So, that's next episode. Final regular season game. Then we should actually get the week off for quarterfinals if we do make that top two. So that will mean Gomez will be just about fit and ready to go again in the first team. I'll see you for our final round moment game. Lara Shell are waiting. I'm waiting. And I'll see you there for it as well. Until then, though, thanks for watching and take care.